Uh, I think we're stuck. Ah, uh, yeah, no fucking shit. Well, you're driving like a dumbass. Okay, well, maybe if you didn't weigh 6,000 pounds, you wouldn't be weighing down all the tires right now. They're screaming at us as we speak. Fuck, I just missed the turn. Well, maybe if you opened up your fucking eyes, I put the GPS on here two hours ago. Do you want to fucking drive with your no license having ass? SpongeBob ass. I'm feeling kind of hungry. <laughs> Taco Bell or what? <laughs> yes, please. Guys, dinner. I made meatloaf. Yeah, I can smell that. So why'd you get pizza? Okay, well, we've had meatloaf three nights in a row. I thought the kids would enjoy some pizza. I don't care. Okay, well, that meatloaf is so stiff that it could grow legs and walk out of this house on its own. Guys, come eat. And I told you you were too young to start dating. Yeah, you went against what your mom said. Go, go to your room, and I'll be there to talk to you in a second. What? Okay, tell me everything that happened. Oh, no! Oh, honey, you're good. You're good. We'll clean it up. What did I tell you about drinking? Calm down. It didn't spill anything. It was me. Okay? I'm gonna grab some paper towels. Did you get a new dog? Yeah, I got a puppy. <laughs> Aren't we gonna get in trouble? Okay, so that's what I was thinking. So, like, your cat hasn't been eating for, like, a day or two now. So I was thinking we could take her off the leash because she's probably gonna die soon anyways. What? <laughs> this is Stevie, by the way. So I had cash in my purse, and now it's gone. Oh, yeah, I took it out of your purse. What? Why? Because I needed to tip the delivery driver. $20? Okay, well, he was a really good delivery driver. That's all I had. Okay, then I'll just take it out of your rent. Hey, you left the back door open, and now it's freezing in the apartment. But your dog shit on my floor. Okay, well, you should have taken her out for a walk. I didn't tell you to get a dog. Okay, I thought we could work as a team, and now you can pay the heater bill. Wait, what size do you want? They only have small and large. Okay, yeah. Give me, like, a medium. Were you even listening to what I just said? I'm literally listening right now. I just ordered. Obviously, you weren't. We should get tattoos today. That'd be so fun. We should, like, get tattoos today. I literally just said that. I was listening. I was just saying that we should. Wait, what was your degree again? I'm studying psychology. Oh, are you trying to, like, start a business or something? Um, I said psychology. Oh, I thought you said business for some reason. I don't know. I swear you just don't listen. I was listening! Hey, can you help me clean before my mom gets Oh, home? I would love to, but I can't. Why? Okay, well, my doctor said that um, cleaning is actually one of my biggest triggers for my mental health, so I can't really help you out, but I can definitely look around and point stuff out and be your eyes while you clean. Do you want me to turn on subtitles? Oh, I understand what they're saying. You speak Spanish? Uh, I speak eight languages. I'm octolingual. What? Oh, no, it's because I have, like, family from everywhere, so I speak a little bit of French, I speak a little bit of Portuguese, Spanish. I picked up Mandarin in, like, a day. Okay. Have you seen my coat? Oh my god, I know. So there's actually a ghost in this house. I've actually seen like atoms floating around and ending up in random spots. It's so weird. Is that it right there? No, that's actually my blanket. Auntie! Oh my god, hey guys! Oh my god, you look so good! Well, she's been gaining a lot of weight. Okay, well, at least she gains in the right spots. Come here. Well, Adrian's been wearing purses to school. And I bet you he rocks that purse really well. Yeah, you know where you're, you get it from? Your dad. What? You know what they called him in high school? Sperm well. No, they yeah, didn't. Yeah, because he gobbled up all the sperm. So wear purses if you want to. Auntie, what are you doing? Oh, <laughs> you scared the shit out of me. Here, put this in the uh, refrigerator for me. Okay. You've been drinking a lot lately. And what about it? I'm just worried. Have you ever thought I'd drink because I want to fucking escape you? You're so fucking draining, I need a drink right now. Do you need a fucking drink? Worry about yourself and get the fuck out of my face. Didn't mean to upset you. Dude, why the fuck didn't you wake us up? I didn't know I was supposed to. No, I don't want to fucking hear it because we were telling you all of our fucking plans yesterday. You should have known since we weren't up, you should have gotten us up. I didn't know. Dude, you're fucking worthless, dude. I'm so tired of my mom. Do you guys want some food? I'm ordering some. Your mom's talking to you. Yeah, I hear her talking. It's bad for my mental health to have useless conversations with her. She knows what the fuck I like to eat and she's playing dumb. Hey, I'm going to work. Why do I care? I just thought I would tell you. By the way, your makeup looks like shit. Dude, your fucking fat ass ate my food! What? If there's food in the fridge that you didn't buy, then obviously it's not for you. That food's been sitting there for like seven fucking days with your lazy ass. Not to mention you don't look like you need the food either. Get out of my room. Just stop taking shit that's not yours. I'm taking these. What are you doing in my room? She doesn't like sleeping in here and she definitely doesn't fucking like you. I just killed my ex, not the you suck dick at singing! Shut the fuck up! That's why no one fucking likes you and your breath stinks. Get the fuck out of my face. Did you fucking steal my socks with the flowers on them? Yeah, why? Okay, well give them back to me because you have fucking elephant feet and your feet smell like shit. I'd rather have stinky feet than fucking chlamydia six times. Get the fuck out of my room. What the fuck are you looking at? I had a bad day. Look at me. No one's fucking looking at you. 
So I'm talking to this new guy and he's so nice. Another one? How many people are you talking to? Just the one. No, because I don't want to hear it when you come to me saying that he's bored and you're crying again. Why are you being so rude? I'm not being rude. There's just more important things like your bad grades and your bad attitude. Thank you. I can finally fit in my jeans again. And how long before you can't fit into it again? What? I'm not being rude. I'm not. I'm just saying there's a constant cycle where you show me that you can fit into something and a week later you get motivated and then you just lose it. Okay? I'm just pointing something out. So I got this really good scholarship. And when did you apply for this? Like two months ago. Okay, and how'd you get that with that 2.1 GPA? I wrote an essay. No, I, that sounds fishy to me. Send that to me. Send that link to me. Thank you. Are you okay? What's going on? No, I'm not okay. So now I have to mop this floor because no one wants to clean it. And now I'm sick and I have to do it by myself. I can mop. No, it's fine. It's helping me stand up so I don't pass out. <coughs> what are you doing? I'm fixing this because you could have fixed this a long time ago, but now here I am sick having to do it for you. <coughs> no, you need to turn that down. It's making my head rattle. Okay. If I enjoy this, you're well, now I can't <coughs> hear anything. Okay, well, the subtitles work just fine. You can read. Honey, you're going to ruin that sweater. Can you mind your own fucking business for once and close the fucking door behind you? No one wants to take advice when you're literally fucking balding. I can literally see your scalp, and whatever hair you have left is already fucking fried. Worry about your own hair. Your fucking card expired on my Amazon. What's your card number? What are you trying to buy? None of your fucking business. We're trying to buy something. It's fine. I can no, my mom it. owes me one. It's four seven. Oh, you won't fucking tell me it. Send it to my phone. I'm not going to fucking remember that. Yeah, I'm really proud of them for everything. Can you stop fucking holding my friend hostage? She doesn't care what you have to fucking say. I'm tired of you fucking bragging about me. It's so embarrassing. Let's go. Can I have this? I already said no. Just put it back in the car. I'm gonna get in trouble. Okay, well then I'll pay for it myself. Your mom's not gonna punish me. Why are you telling him that? No, because I said so. If I want to purchase that on my own, I can. If I said so, he can have it. Thank you. Hey, you seem a little down today. What's going on? You don't need to check on me every time I'm upset. Okay, I don't need to hear you yelling at me. If you're having a bad mental day, let me know. You don't need to be a little fucker. Come to me when you have time. Hey. Um, I'm worried about Aiden. He's been in his room all day long. He's not talking to anyone. Yeah, he does this every month claiming he has depression. Yeah, that's how depression works. It's like an ongoing thing. So let me know when your kids are your priority. You're being a bitch. And your outfit makes you look fat. Mom, look what I drew. Mom. He's trying to show you something. I'm on the phone. Okay, well then get off the phone then. Honey, show me. What is that? A dragonfly. Okay, well that's cool. I really don't need your help parenting my kids when you don't have any. Okay, well it kind of seems like you do. I don't need kids to understand how to treat people. And they can always come live with their auntie as long as they want, because God knows how to make more money. Did you forget I had you on Snapchat? Oh. Yeah, I saw your story last night. If you don't want your parents to know, don't be stupid enough to post it on your story. You look fucking stupid. And you were smoking it wrong too. This weird guy keeps messaging me. Oh my God, you just sent him your brother's nudes. Ew, why would I have those? Okay, well I can send them to you. I have them. What? No. Okay. My stepdad wants to turn my phone off. You should cut the brakes to his work truck. What? No, no, listen, listen. Because if he crashes on the way to work and is in the hospital, he's not going to remember to shut your phone off if he's, like, dying. You're insane. I'm just saying. I'm definitely not making rent this month. Oh, my God, then just don't pay him. What do you mean? No, I mean, like, you could live in my backyard. No, because I was thinking, I have, like, two tents, or, like, full-size tents, and I could, like, dig a hole for you and everything to go to the bathroom in the back, and I could, like, Uber Eats you food outside and stuff. Just don't pay him. Can we go to the gas station and get snacks? Who's asking? I'm asking. That doesn't sound like something you would say. Did Sadie tell you to come ask me? Yes, because we're hungry. Okay, well, she can use her words. Okay, so it's a no until she wants to ask me herself. Sadie, you can speak. Did Sadie leave the refrigerator door open? No, we didn't go because in there. Because everything in there has gone bad. And I'm going to repurchase everything. We didn't go in there. Okay, well, it wasn't a ghost. Sadie, if you want to leave doors open, you can go home. Is Sadie ready to go? She's staying another day. I thought she was staying for two days. No, she's staying another. Okay, well, we have things to do around here, like cleaning, so unless she wants to help clean. The parents are still gone. Let me know when I have the whole story. Let me know. Hey. Hey, when did you give your ugly-ass boyfriend a key to our apartment? He fucking scared the shit out of me earlier. I gave him a key because he pays more bills than your broke ass. Now get in the car. I want to get Chick-fil-A. Dude, what the fuck are you doing? Why are you going through all my shit? I was looking for my fucking chapstick. Oh, <laughs> it was my pocket. And that bag smells like dog ass. Dude, what the fuck was that for? Because I was in the mood to hit you and I should have hit you harder. Hey, do you want to get food? Uh, yeah, if you're the one who's paying. Why the fuck would I pay when you literally just got paid? Well, why the fuck would I pay if it was your idea?
Whatever, get in the car and hurry the fuck up. I know your fat ass is hungry. What's the Hulu password? I don't fucking know. Why? Do you literally fucking know anything? I swear you are completely fucking useless. And why the fuck does it smell like deviled eggs in here? I don't know, but you might be talking about the fried onion smell that's coming from under your shirt. Now get the fuck out of my room. Kids, I got some gifts! We don't have room for that. Okay, well then you can make room. I thought this would look beautiful with your homecoming dress, Elena. Is that <laughs> Cartier? Yeah, it's Cartier. Because I actually thought of your daughter. You can actually, you know, buy things for children these days instead of working them to death. It'll look gorgeous. Hey, I stole this back from your mom's closet. If I catch you using it to talk to that boy down the street that smells like an eight-pack of hot dogs, I'm snatching that right back from you. Okay? Dinner's almost ready. Bed now, both of you. Jesus Christ! We got the fun police. There's 30 minutes left in the movie. You'll live. The other night, you didn't mind keeping them up all night when they are detail cleaning your bathroom. It's okay. You guys aren't going to bed yet. <laughs> They're not allowed to watch Calm that. Calm down, okay? They're too young for that. Okay, well, she's like 16, right? I'm 15. And him, well... Nothing scarier than living with you, I can guarantee you that. So, I thought it'd be a really good idea if this coming Friday, we all went to California Adventures. <laughs> no, the kids have school. Oh, fucking come on! You used to just school and hang out with homeless people under the bridge. I said no. Okay, well, they're already missing school because I called them, and I said that both of their grandparents were dead. So, have fun with that. What are you doing? Oh, sorry. Look at them while you're in there. Grab that skinny pop in the back for me. <laughs> I'm hungry. Oh my god, my grandpa's in the hospital again. I would put him down. What? He just has a broken leg. Okay, well, it's like a horse. If it breaks its leg, it's probably gonna die anyways. What is he, like 60? Pull the plug for sure. What? Am I getting pulled over? I don't think that's for us. No, just like speed up or something. Oh my God, what do I say? Okay, when he gets to the window, just say that we're like on a, our way to a Trump rally or something. He'll love that. My mom's been on my ass for you days. You should probably block her. And not only that, you should also send her a ransom note in the mail. That's kind of extreme. Okay, well, she wouldn't be acting like that. She thought you were kidnapped. Not to mention we could probably get some money out of her, too.